Hey guys, today we will be racing the new pint-sized Bugs 3 Mini against the original formidable Bugs 3. Who's going to win? Who's going to end up on top? Stick with us and find out. So the new Bugs 3 is available from Amazon, GearBest, and TomTop. It has one key advantage the original does not have, which is the ability to fly in acro mode. Now we're actually going to be racing the F100. It's available in white and black and often comes packaged with an action camera that you can put below it. And that's one key advantage of the F100 or Bugs models is that they are, have a lot of lifting power. You can even put a gimbal as two axis while carry a gimbal. We'll have the links to all these things and the drones below. We even stuck a 360 camera on top of the F100 as you can see here. Now the Bugs 3 Mini does have one thing in common with the original. It is extremely durable. Uh, we inadvertently tested that a few times as you can see here landed upright not even a bent prop or a scratch. Uh, these things just keep going. We really love the Bugs 3 and the new Bugs 3 Mini. But without further ado, we get these guys up in the air. We're going to race them four times and see who wins. Now I'm going to spoil for you a little bit. The F100 or Bugs 3 does tend to come in front in these races. Now the Bugs 3 Mini uh, will almost tie or tie in some of them as well. So which of these two great drones is right for you? They're both about a hundred bucks. Uh, with one, you get the lifting capacity, the ability to carry all kinds of things, including an inexpensive two axis gimbal. With the other, the ability to fly in acro mode. It, the choice is yours. We like them both. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, get one of these drones, support us, click on the links below. We'll check you next time.